Welcome back to the Sunday Sports Frenzy. Saturday was finally the day. The rumors and the guessing could be put to rest when the day would come as the historic Williams Grove Bridge finally comes down. Demo started bright and early before the crack of dawn to safely dismantle and lower the bridge down onto a tractor trailer. It was an eight hour process dividing the bridge into three sections. Put this into, but this isn't the last time you'll see the old bridge. It will have a new home. It has been donated to the Eastern Museum of Motor Racing in York Springs, York County, so race fans for years to come can see the bridge. A brand new bridge will replace it, replace the 76 year old famous walkway. More about the historic bridge to come in the coming weeks. Saturday also concluded the racing season at BAPS. Chase Dietz and Troy Walgaman battle for position. Dylan Norris and Derek Locke get together in turns one and two that causes Locke to roll. He set the quick down in Group B and on a restart, Danny Dietrich slides Wagaman for the lead and cashes in on a 25 grand to close out the season. A good point to note, Aaron Bollinger charges from 16th to 2nd, racing for John Anthony and Travis Esch.